Ready? Ready? Go. Lay down. Lay down. Lay. Good girl. Good girl. <laughs> go ahead. You go. You go. No, you go. <laughs> okay, I'll go. I'm Naomi Grevenberg. I am an eco van lifer, dog mom, and master curry chef. Oh, nice. I'm Dustin Grevenberg. <laughs> I am Naomi's partner, first and foremost. Master driver of old vans and. <laughs> You're <laughs> silly. A proud dog parent. This is Amara. She's our companion and riding partner. I'd and say she's the captain of, she's the captain. of the Iri to Aurora boat. She guides us where we need to go. <laughs> well, we've been on the road since 2016 in our 1985 Volkswagen Vanagon, and let me tell you that van has come a long way. I started Diversify Van Life in late summer of 2019, actually. I started it um, out of frustration um, of the lack of representation of BIPOC and other marginalized groups of people in the van life media. In order for us to have an intentionally inclusive community, we have to invite everyone to dance everyone's stories need to be told, and they weren't. A group of friends and myself decided we're gonna do our own thing. We'll create our own media, we'll tell our own stories, and we'll put it out into the world. And that's what we did. We recently launched the Diversified Van Life uh, BIPOC Guide to Van Life in the Outdoors. We invite everyone to share their stories on there and share their experiences and help, you know, individuals like ourselves um, get into van life and make it accessible. So that's what it's all about, basically, really accessibility. What helps us the most on the road is our CFX3 power cooler. The freezer has changed so much because um, for many reasons, um, I have less food waste because I get to freeze food um, and since having Amara, um, being in like hot climates, we get to have ice for her water bowl, which she absolutely loves ice. We get to keep ice cream, which Dustin really loves. We don't have to be in town every two or three days, buying more groceries, getting ice. We can go off grid for longer periods of time. It gives us peace of mind, like knowing that we have, we have what we need. We have everything we need to sustain ourselves. The Dometic fridge, the CFX, doesn't draw too much energy, and since we're entirely solar power dependent, that's really, really beneficial. The Dometic water jug is just so easy to pour. I love the fact that it has a grip at the bottom, um, so it's really easy to handle, and the two straps, oh man, it's, it's perfect. The fact that it's stackable and compact and actually has the little nozzle for changing the, the pressure of pouring is ideal for van life. And Amar really loved it because she got to drink out the stream. She loves drinking water from a stream. Our first night in the van, we drove 400 miles the first day in the van. We never drive that far in our van. We found a spot and backed in, and then we just sat and looked at each other for what felt like an eternity in silence. What do we do now? Yeah, and Dustin said, well, let's pop the top and let's settle in. Yeah, I tossed and turned all night, and the next morning I woke up to the trill of a mockingbird and the feeling of freedom. We were free to choose. We were free to decide what we wanted to do. We had a clean slate and we got to decide how we were gonna rewrite our story. No matter what you want to do or set out to do, there's always gonna be people who doubt the dream, who 
would stumble you. Uh, and so you might as well do it anyway. Mm -hmm.